Traders, welcome to KinFX Academy YouTube channel. My name is Akian Lakin. I am the lead instructor. So, guys, based on popular demand on how to trade Dex, Dex up and down. So, you can see on my screen that I'm cashing spike on Dex 900. You can see the results here. So, let me simply tell you how this market works, how this new directive market works. So the easy way to cash spike on the DEX 900 up and down is that you will go to, when you are trading up, go to 30 minute time frame, find a support level. You understand? You can see that the market is trading up. You understand? What we need is the spike. So find a support level. You can see the place I mark out. This is support level, this is support level. And when price come back, to the level then go to one minute time frame wait for a spike to happen you understand wait for a spike to happen so i'm trying to so you can see when the price come back here this spike happen this spike little spike happen you understand so after it happened, I enter for buy. I enter for buy along the process. Oh no, sorry. That was not it. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry. This is it. This is the spike that gave me the entry. This is the spike that gave me the entry. So because I know that the spike was complete before I put on a buy. So then after the buy, uh, the market consolidates for a while, then the spike happened, then price come back to the support level again before it trend up. You understand? Before it trade up. So that is the simple way I know on how to trade text markets. You understand? For now, I have not come up with any indicators to scalp decks or to cast the spike on decks. But with this simple strategy, you can actually make good money from Dex markets, Dex 900 up and down. So if you are trading Dex 900 down, if you are trading the down market, you will look for resistance level on 30 minute time frame. You understand? I think the network is not that fine. Okay, fine. So you will look for a resistance level like this because we want to catch the spike so once you can see a resistance level on 30 minute time frame go to one minute time frame like already explained the other time so wait for a spike then if the spike the condition is let me explain this in details you understand the condition is the spike must not that big you understand your entry spike you can see the one that happened here you can see this one that is not that big you understand so if you see a longer spike like this you should stay out if you see a longer spike like this you stay out always for retracement the market to come back to that place you understand so this is uh, that is how it works you understand just follow this simple rule if you want to trade text desk is very volatile you understand it's not something you use more account to trade and once you are trading with any strategy you are using let it be in support of this spike you understand dex 900 spike up y dex 900 up spike up y dex 900 down spike down same thing applicable to the all the dex markets you understand so i wish happy trading and always trade responsible